Hey everyone and welcome back to another Jazzy Wicks candle review. Today I'm reviewing a candle that I've been after for quite a long time. I've got Yankee Candles Cinnamon Toast. So this is no longer available. Um, it's, it's a harder to find scent now. There's still ones floating around online from collectors. They range between £30 and £40 at the moment, the people that are selling them on. But when I've seen them previously, people were selling them for like 40, 50 pounds and I just didn't want to pay that. But it looks like a few collectors are selling candles off more recently at a decent price. So it's available on eBay, Facebook. Keep your eyes peeled for it if it sounds like one that you'd want to try. It's the large 22 ounce jar, roughly 150 hour burn time. And this was, I believe the pour of this exact jar is 2011. But it looks like they were still floating around in about 2016 as well. So it is an old jar. Um, it is a US scent as well. So when you do come across them in the UK, that might be why they're a bit dearer and collectors are trying to sell them on for a little bit more money. So you know I love cinnamon. I would even class myself as a cinnamon and spice connoisseur because I will, I will burn cinnamon scents all year long, clove, nutmeg, cinnamon. I don't have to wait for Christmas to burn them scents. They're my absolute favourite, which is why I really, really wanted to try it, cinnamon toast. Um, there is another cinnamon Yankee candle as well. I think it's cinnamon bun. I'm not too sure. There is another one that I've been looking to get that's discontinued as well now. Um, quite an older scent. So this was one of the two that I wanted to grab. Happy I got it for £30. I have burnt this by the wick and put it under the lamp. That's why you can still see the wick sticking up there. So I've burnt it a little while by the wick and then I swapped it over to the lamp to give it um, a go over both ways that you can burn these. I can't find the top, middle and bottom notes for this because they're not on a website anymore. But the scent description for this was a warm, delicious tree, cinnamon spice with a buttery note. So you can see here... This is the colour that the wax was, but this is where it's pulled after I've put it under my lamp. Um, you can see the wick has been burnt at the top there as well. So I'll just show you the label a little bit closer as well, because I do really love that design. So really, really was excited to burn this. I started burning it in my room, um, the same as where I was burning key lime pie. So it's a smaller size room. There's no draft, um, gives it plenty plenty of room to throw in um but not too much so it can't get lost i couldn't smell a thing not anything so i thought right next thing let's take it downstairs let's put it under the candle lamp my candle lamp is my saving grace normally when i find a candle that doesn't throw very well pop it under the lamp it makes it last longer and helps it throw a little bit stronger this candle, and if you've watched my channel for a while, you're going to be shocked to hear me say it. This is the first cinnamon candle I've ever had that I did not like. I couldn't couldn't smell anything burning it by the wick. And then when I put it underneath the lamp, it made my house smell so musky and unclean. Like, I know it's not a clean and fresh scent. I know it's not like baby powder or anything like that. But I didn't even get... I didn't get any notes of any cinnamon or spice come from this at all. Whatever the combination of notes that are in this candle, for me, obviously, everyone smells things differently. You might have had this and loved it. Um, I've read reviews online saying it's, it's nice and spicy, but not too much. So the cinnamon isn't overpowering. But for me, whatever the blend of spices in this are, or the buttery notes, or like a sugary vanilla note, whatever it is that they've mixed together in this. Or maybe I've just got a dud jar, but I thought it was awful once I burn it under the lamp. So burning it by the wick, I didn't get any smell. And then burning it underneath my lamp, it I walked into my house a couple of times after it being on for a while, and it just smelt like, you know that sort of smell when you go away for a couple of weeks and you come home and nothing's been like sprayed around your house and no housework's been done like a really musky smell like I don't know it, it was a bit like it could I could even compare it to like when the dogs my two dogs need a bath like that sort of smell like so say I've left the house for two weeks and left my dogs in there for two weeks and no housework's been done it was that sort of musky unclean smell and I've never had a candle like that before. 
I actually walked in and I the first time I walked in after burning it under the lamp, I was walking around looking to see what the smell was because I thought, what? Have I left something out in the house that smells like that? No, it was this candle. So I'm very glad that I didn't spend any more than £30 on it. Um, let me know what you thought if you've had this because, like I say, the reviews online for this are good. So I don't know if maybe I've just got a dud candle or my nostrils just don't agree with the scent notes in this. But I was devastated. I love, love a cinnamon candle. And this one for me it was a big, big no-no. Um, I can't even really give it a throw rating. I, it didn't really smell of anything upstairs burning it by the wick. And then some horrible, musky, dirty smell when I was burning it underneath the candle lamp. And I've burnt other candles under my lamp recently. So I know it's not the lamp playing up. Um yeah it just wasn't not for me at all which i'm gobsmacked myself because i thought this is going to be amazing i'm going to burn it a little bit i'm going to love it it'll be hoarded um i'll only burn it when people come round. but now i don't even want to keep the rest of this um it's not even worth keeping it on my shelf to gather dust because i won't burn it again i was not keen on it at all um it was not what i expected if you want in my opinion a cinnamon candle from Yankee Candle. Play it safe and go with cinnamon sticks. I love cinnamon sticks. It's a it's a classic here in the UK. Um, always smells nice and strong of cinnamon. Um, easy to get, normal price. Obviously, I'm hoping the other cinnamon one, which I'm sure it's cinnamon bun, the other one that I wanted to try. But if I get that and it was so much more amazing, then obviously I would let you guys know. But at the moment, as it stands, Yankee Candle cinnamon sticks is probably my preferred Yankee Candle cinnamon scent. Um, there is other ones out there that have hints of cinnamon in it, but if you love cinnamon the same as me, then cinnamon sticks is the way to go if you just want that pure Christmassy scented candle. So yeah, let me know if you've had cinnamon toast. Um, I was really shocked with what I thought of it. And um, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing anyone in the comments that has tried it and if you wasn't pleased with it or if, if maybe you was and it sounds like I've got a dud, but yeah, let me know in the comments down below. Um, as always, thank you for watching and I'll get a new review out for you soon.